Welcome to the Solar Decathlon Minute. Today is the moment we've all been waiting for. The day began with Stevens receiving top prize in the engineering contest. Now, let's go right to the big show. The first place overall winner of the Solar Decathlon 2015 goes to Stevens Institute of Technology. Our flood proofing aspects, a lot of the testing that we did for our shutters and um, the entire flood proofing design that we made. From the very beginning, we, we thought we not only wanted to model, um, design something great, but we also really wanted to test it uh, before coming here. Um, and so that was kind of central. They really uh, appreciated the energy modeling that we did uh, for the house. Uh, basically modeling the home um, throughout the year to try and um, account for how much energy we think we're going to use back in New Jersey based on the climate. We were able to place uh, as first place in seven of the ten contests at the decathlon this year, which was absolutely amazing for us. We performed better than we ever uh, thought was possible. Um, and uh, our team couldn't be more excited. Our first time participating in 2011, we got 14th place. Uh, back in 2013, we got fourth place, and now with first place, uh, the trajectory has been amazing, and uh, I know it's been an amazing educational experience for everyone that's touched the project in any way, so we're really proud for, uh, for our school, Stevens, and also for New Jersey. Congratulations goes to you at Buffalo, who finished nine points behind Stevens with 941 points, and Finishing solidly in the third place position with a total of 910 points is Team Solar Cal Poly. For more results, go to solardecathlon.gov. And that wraps up the Solar Decathlon Minute for 2015. The Solar Village is open tomorrow from 11 to 7 at the Orange County Great Park. Make sure you take advantage of your last opportunity to visit this incredible event. Thanks for watching.